Hello and welcome to another episode of Periscope 101 Tutorials. Thanks for watching. Today I'm going to show you how to tweet from inside the Periscope app. This is a trick that was originally pointed out or discovered, if you would, by uh, my man JB Howard. Um, I'm going to give him a quick shout out right here just by going to his profile and just searching for him real quick under the search people function, JB Howard. You get to see if you want to follow him on Periscope, you're more than welcome to do that. There's my man J. Bob, Jim Bob Howard. It's his full name, techie speaker, author, home decor, and there's there's his website. Follow him if you would. But I'm going to show you today because it's very difficult um, to follow the step by step when somebody's doing a scope. There's a lot of questions you need. Some people are very visual, and so I'm going to show you today exactly step by step on how to tweet from inside the Periscope app. By the way, if, in case you're not familiar with me, my name is Ray Garcia. I'm a digital marketer, graphic designer, and a social media geek. You can also find me on Periscope by going to the search function and looking for Ray G Creative. Uh, with that said, let's continue. And I'm going to show you right now how to tweet from inside the app. So when you go to a broadcast, right, and I'm just going to pick a random broadcast here. Um, I'll pick Scott Williams here just at random for no specific reason. So here we are. Um, it appears that he's at an airplane um, with a bunch of people there. So when you go, when you come to a to a scope, the way to tweet out from a from a from inside the Periscope app, first you must be on an iOS device. Otherwise, it won't it won't work. And you you can you can you can tweet the uh, the host but you can also tweet anybody you want so that's the other thing too you're essentially writing a tweet from within the app and this is how you do it you swipe to the right on iOS and you go to share once you hit share you want to hit the button that says share on Twitter once you share on Twitter you'll see this this um this menu will pop up and this menu is just uh, from within iOS it's got the account, um, my personal account, my Twitter account already in there. Um, and at this point, you can just tweet out the link. But this is the whole discovery portion of it. You can actually just tweet anybody you want on here by just selecting the entire thing and deleting it. At that point, you, it's just a regular tweet, 140 characters. I'm going to go ahead and write myself a tweet just for testing purposes so that you guys can see how it works. This is just a test so it appears that it's giving me a bit of a bug there but there you go just put somebody's handle on there and then after that you can just post it so keep in mind you can tweet the host of those of the scope you're watching or you can tweet any friend or anybody on Twitter if you just wanted to say, hey, come watch this, hey, I'm watching so-and-so, you know, give scope on whatever topic, whatever you want to do on here. Um, write yourself a note, send yourself a tweet like I'm doing. Um, just, and it'll go straight on your Twitter account. So let's see, I'm going to post. So boom, I just posted this. Now I'm going to go to my Twitter account just to see if it worked. So when I go to Twitter, there's my Twitter account. And boom, you can see it just updated, and there you have it. This is just a test, and it's at me, and, and there it is. It's been posted. So you can put any handle you want on there, and it's supposed to um, sort of guess also the, the, the Twitter handle, although it was not working for me on this tutorial. Now, the other thing people are having issues with is how to direct message from within the Periscope app, which is another thing as well that you can do. And I'm going to show you how again. So here we are again. I'm, on, I'm in the same scope. As you can see, I go to share again. I pick share on Twitter. And now this is the thing that you got to do to direct message. Keep in mind that the other person has to have the option on their personal account, their Twitter account, uh, to accept direct messages from just about anyone. Or if you guys are following each other, you you will be able to direct message that person at that point. But Twitter has just recently changed that. Um, now you can, if you choose to have open direct messaging, anybody can direct message you at that point. Most people, I believe, have done that. I know for sure I have, and other people have also said that they have. And this is how you do a direct, direct message or DM 
from Periscope to a Twitter account. So I'm going to do one for myself again. And the very important thing to do is to put the letter D, space, and then you have to put the handle without the at symbol. So I'm going to put Ray G Creative. That's my handle on Twitter. And it just happens to be the same handle on Periscope. And now I write my message. So now I'm going to say, um, this is a DM from Periscope. There you have it. I'm going to post. I have just sent it over to my own account. I could have picked anybody's anybody actually at that point you can direct message yourself notes as well if you wanted to if you don't want to miss something you don't want to miss what's going on there you have just direct message message yourself a note so now let's go back to my Twitter and see if this worked so here I am give it a couple a minute or so I guess let me go into messages real quick so when I go into messages you can see that seven seconds ago I have a DM for myself right there and as you can see this is a dm from periscope there you have it that's how you dm from periscope itself that's how you tweet from periscope itself without having to leave the broadcast you're watching with that said thank you so much for watching thank you so much for tuning in if you have any questions at all please don't hesitate to leave them right below this video or find me on Periscope under the handle Ray G Creative, and I'll be more than happy to help you out. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and follow me. Have a good day.